Now, I do love nitrous, and it works very well in the Cummins cart, and it's a great power adder, but it's, it's, it's limited. It's, it's difficult, or turbo just works off of waste heat, waste energy that your engine has anyway. It's just harnessing energy that you're throwing out the tailpipe. So just really, like, basic level, the exhaust comes out of the engine. It spins a turbine wheel, kind of think of like a hydroelectric dam that generates power, spins a big paddle wheel. Yeah. And the shaft of that paddle wheel spins an a air compressor, compressor, an air compressor that compresses air yeah. and forces it. And so the exhaust and the air never touch. A lot of people yeah, don't understand like, that. Why do you want exhaust to go back in your motor? It's not. It's just using the exhaust energy to create energy through the turbine wheel. And that empowers a compressor wheel, which takes air from your air filter, sucks it in, compresses it a bunch, and throws in your motor, and you make more power. A lot of times, like when people see the large turbo on my truck, they think it's two turbos. They see the big <laughs> turbine housing and the compressor housing. They don't realize that's all one unit. Mm -hmm. And so each oh, yeah. turbo has like two, they call them snail, snail shells. Scroll, it looks like a scroll yeah. type thing. And so there's an exhaust scroll and an intake scroll. Uh, and so that together, two of those make one turbo. So I know this is pretty elementary from, for a lot of people listening, but I'm surprised often I get that question.